we're going to do, I'm going to do my first triptych. Um, thought I would uh, let you guys join in on the fun. <laughs> Here are the colors that I'm going to use. I have uh, Apple Barrel Bahama Blue. This is uh, Folk Art Metallic Pure Gold. There's a whole bunch of different golds. This one is pure gold. We'll get back to this one. Uh, Fine Touch White. It's the Titanium White. Fine Touch Mars Black. Fine Touch, is it uh, just straight up pink? <laughs> and Fine Touch, nah. yeah, neutral, neutral gray. <laughs> now this one here, um, this is a little bonus. I had made, I did a, a pour, I did a pour, and um, it had a lot of uh, blue and green and and uh, all kinds of wonderful colors in it, and it turned out to be this color, and I really liked it, so I called it my teal, but there's no way I'm ever going to replicate it again, so I thought that I would put it in something really nice, like this. Okay, is that crooked? Ah, you get the idea. All right, still trying to figure out camera placement, so... <clears throat> What we will do is we'll pour some gray. Okay. Dark. Dark. Okay. Now I also got a hold of a different hair dryer that I actually have a little bit more control over. This one is a old Vidal Sassoon. Uh, it is a 1500. Uh, it has no setting for hot or cool or anything. It is literally high, off, and low. So um, I attached the funnel up here and hopefully We'll see how it works. I tried it earlier and it, it was awesome. I'll take a picture of that one and put that on here and show you what I did. But um, yeah, so we're gonna try this one. <laughs> Be very careful and see what happens. You know what? I just realized I don't need to move these for you guys. Sorry about that. Okay, put this over here. Guys, you wanna see it, right? <laughs> okay, here we go again. Okay, I can already tell I have a lot more control over this one, but it's really hot. I don't know if that's going to affect it or not, but we'll find out. Oh, one thing that you should know, uh, if you're doing the edges or you're doing anything and you have several or you have a big one, when you do the edge, don't pull your hand up across the painting because it'll drip every time. Something I found out the hard way. <laughs> it really sucked. Okay, you know, like I just did. Everybody gets pink. This is gonna be fun. Alright. Everybody gets pink. Yeah, same goes with your cups, too. Uh, gray, since this one does not have gray, we're going to add a little gray over here. Okay. And then... We'll do the black on that one in the end. Uh, black, it tends to take over a lot, so be careful with your black. Special color. Oh, I can't wait to see how this one turns out. Okay, this is all I've got. Look at that. Oh, that looks so pretty. <laughs> this is all I've got of it, though. Uh, all right. And cold. Okay. 
that it's gold. Okay, so of course my phone rang, knocked off the video. <laughs> We're gonna have to, I had to reset it. it said, yeah, hopefully this is okay. <laughs> All right, so we've got the gold. We need a little bit of black in this one since it's not on this one. Okay. See that? That right there. That's that's what I was telling you about. Blow it up over and then out. Seeing black underneath there, that's going to be interesting what that ends up like. All right, there we go. <clears throat> oh my goodness. That black just took over, didn't it? See what I was saying about the black getting dominant. I put too much in there and it really did its job. Okay, so I like these. I will show the final at the end. Happy painting! Okay, so we have the triptych that I attempted and it is a lot different. I actually tried to um, blow it out with my mouth and uh, I got a little crazy with it, but I actually kind of like it. It's uh, I the way I did it, apparently I was able to duplicate it across all three of them so they look like they belong together. So here you go, let me give you a close up. <clears throat> I don't know if you can see some of that gold in there. I have not uh, acrylic this yet. I have not sealed it, <clears throat> but uh, that will be done later today. This one had the most gold in it. Might be able to see a little bit of that shimmer, I hope. There is also that turquoise um, that had some, Focus some sparkle in it. We will see how well that comes out um, once I seal it, once I put the acrylic on. It will uh, actually make these colors pop quite a bit, which is the beauty of having <laughs> using acrylic for a seal. There's some more of that gold. You might be able to see some of that there, but okay. So again, those are the three. There's the triptych.